I'm going to teach you how to reduce the length of these jogging pants. This uh, project is a little bit different than the regular hem we do on our pants because uh, since it's included with the elastic cuff or um, fabric cuff bottom of the pant hemming. But it's not impossible as you can see I have already removed them from the bottom of my pants because I just want to save time so they were stitched together I just use a seam ripper and um, remove them if you see my videos regular I have used a seam ripper many times so you can do that on, you know by yourself okay so first of all you have to measure how much length you need actual full length so after removing these cuffs the full length right now I have 38 inches which is actually the exactly length I have needed for my pen that's mean this length fabric is extra which we also going to measure so remember the 38 length full and this one is one and a half inch so we simply going to remove one and a half inch from this pen why we are removing exactly one full one and a half inch because this cuff is already prepared we no need to fold anything or you know do any any other stuff for folding and not even we need any extra folding just a quarter inch you know so that's mean we don't need extra fabric for the big fold okay so simply I'm just going to cut up one and a half inch since it's a stretchy fabric so that will work out perfectly after cutting both panels then I will show you how to pin up and sew So the next step we are going to do just a fold a little quarter inch and iron press inside okay just a quarter inch not too much So we have iron pressed little quarter inch fold inside. The next step before we going to attach these cuffs to pant, I am going to do a zigzag stitch around the cuff top so my elastic and the fabric could be secured. You can also do the overlock stitch. So since I'm just using the sewing machine, so I'm just going to do quicker zigzag stitch on that and then we are just going to pin up and stitch on the right side of the fabric on the top of this. So let's head to the sewing machine now. The things of God, redeeming your time is so important. What do I mean? Time is redeemed when you make the most of your life by fulfilling God's purpose. As you line up your life and seize every opportunity for useful service, your life takes on an efficient quality. That may be difficult to imagine since you're so busy. But as you focus on doing the business of God, time expands. I don't know who wrote this poem, but it's so true. I have only just a minute, only 60 seconds in it, just a tiny little minute, but eternity is in it. As your heart becomes more dedicated to God, your claimed recover, rescue, 
and regain the minutes, hours, and days of your life for His glory. Dear Jesus, what a precious gift time is. Please help me aware of my stewardship of this great award. Help me make good use of every hour, realizing that once spent, it can never be returned to me. Amen. Thank you so much for watching our today's sewing project and as you can see we have did our project very nicely and neat. If you really get inspired by our today's sewing project please give this video a big thumbs up. Don't forget to hit like, subscribe and share. God bless you all. Love you all and have a lovely fabulous day. Bye bye.